Alright, it is episode 12 of this Final Fantasy VI Let's Play here on Let's Play with Brigands. We are back in the Opera House. I'm sorry, the Auction House, not the Opera House. It's very different. Uh, we're in the Auction House, and we're hoping for some Magisite. Before we get going. Yes. I believe there's two in here. I will definitely bid on that. If we start with... <laughs> there's nothing I can't buy. Oh god, is that kid gonna want it for like a million GP? Because I might be kind of screwed if that's the case. Hopefully he's not here. Hell yeah, I'll buy it. Uh-oh. Oh crap. Let's keep going for a while. No? Okay. Just give it to me. There you go, thank you. It's not really how auctions work, but whatever. Alright. I'll come back very soon. So soon that uh, I won't even pause the video. Right, let's try this again. What do we got? What do we got? Ooh, mystery box. Ah, uh, yeah, get me out of here. I'm good. I don't need cherub down. Why would I? If I didn't want it for five grand, why would I want it for ten grand? The worst auction guy ever. Uh, just keep trying. What do we got another chair down. Um, all right. Here's the thing. I'm gonna pause the video. I'm going to uh, get my people leveled up a little bit with their magic spells, with their magic sight. I'm gonna get this other magic sight, and then uh, we're gonna unpause it when we get to the floating continent, and we're gonna have our big showdown with Kefka finally. So, um. Kind of an anticlimactic start to this video, but it's going to get much, much more epic. So, uh, hang on one second. Okay, so I think the best place to actually get uh, magic experience is on the floating continent. So, let's go to the floating continent. I'll pause it there and do my thing, and then, yeah. So, let's do that. Quick, let's jump on that thing. So, I can only take three folks in my party. I should actually probably, um... I do anything, I should get everyone rested. Um, yeah, is this gonna cure everybody? Well, she's the one who needs the magic really back. Is this guy cure everybody? No, don't do anything. Is there like a place to sleep on here? Zedzer's like, I have a place you can sleep. No, Zedzer! Alright, you're selling me stuff. Isn't this, don't you cure me or something? Yeah. There you go. Is that for everybody? Hopefully it's for everybody. Okay. <sighs> Alright. So I'm thinking I want probably just two magic users and probably Edgar, because he's got those crazy, crazy tools. So we'll take Terra, we'll take Celis, and we will take a man Edgar. Probably put Edgar in front. Alright. This should be a good landing party. Alright. But we don't go straight to the floating, floating continent, and that's why I uh, unpaused the video right here. Because there's going to be a lot of airborne dudes trying to... Yeah, the Imperial Air Force. The IAF. Yuff. Let's give him a bloody lip. Sky Armor and Spitfire. Alright. So I feel like electricity is always good on... Dudes. Alright, she doesn't really have the spells yet, but... That's fine. Um, flash. And... Bolt 2. Alright, that didn't really do that much. What is this going to do? <laughs> Something. Why don't you slap him? That might take care of it. Nah, okay. Worth a shot. Slap him? There you go. Chainsaw his ass. Don't ask me how you chainsaw a flying enemy, but whatever. It worked. Two magic points. There we go. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Alright, hurry up. Same exact thing. Absolute zero. Um, does she have it? She just says, yeah. Alright, maybe you should start to cure us. And you should do your bolt too. I feel like that's much more powerful. You have two earrings on, that's always a good thing. 
And then the tools, why don't you chainsaw this guy? Hopefully we can kill everyone with this round. Let's see. I'm betting on Bolt 2 quite a bit, and I was smart to. And then the chainsaw's gonna kill that. Alright. Let's heal up between battles here. Actually, you should probably do this since here. Not really pulling your weight here, Meryl. Still looks like Meryl Streep to me from that angle. And then, uh, Tara looks like. Ah, it'll come to me. It will come to me, alright. Three on two, this is manageable. Um. Man, it just feels like a waste, but whatever. Maybe I can get away with just using the single bolt since he slapped it with the black belt. Either way, you should chainsaw that guy. There you go. Nice. And we should see a big guy coming in soon. Maybe after another battle. Yeah. Get these up. Chainsaw him. Terra, you do the exact same thing. Seems to be working. Okay. Something curious approaches. And I guess we get a little nicked there. Alright. So you should see something weird floating across the bottom. Or the background or somewhere. Yeah. What the hell is that thing? I guess he's not here yet. Okay. So we agreed we could do a one-off bolt on that guy, and then Edgar could do his chainsaw magic on the other guy. Chainsaw magic. All right, that didn't work right away. A little more. A little more to that one. Yeah, that, it's a weird, like, explodey puppet or something. I forget how to describe this guy. Weird explodey monster puppet or something. I don't know. He's He takes his time coming around. All right. Tara, you do your thing. Don't morph. Oh god, no. Do not morph. Cool. Alright. That should be the last one, I would think. I would hope. Maybe? Possibly? Anytime? Do I need to... Oh. How the hell did Ultros get on here? The hell, you fly now, Ultros? No, really. This is our last battle. Alright. All you Ultros lovers, soak it up. This is your last chance. I know for a fact he hates lightning. So let's, uh... Just smack him with it. Oh, that's good. All the heavy-hitting spells and tools. On Ultros. I lose again. <laughs> but he brought a friend. Mr. Chupon, come on down. Hello. <laughs> I have two faces. Funga. <laughs> Mr. Chupon's death turn. Terribly powerful. Really? Ow. That didn't hurt that much. Let's bolt them both. And maybe you should do the zone... Uh, I don't even know what that does. Probably not that good. All right. Um... I'd steal some stuff from these guys, but I don't know. I would just wait. Wait to cure. I can flash these dudes, but not like that. Tentacle. Oh, that slaps everybody. That's no good. Alright. Wish I knew what Zone Seek did. On demand right here. Oh well. I think we're staying ahead here. Fireball. Ouch! I think this is gonna hurt. Yeah. Didn't feel good. Edgar's kinda falling behind the count here. I'd uh, prioritize curatives with Terra, but she's just so damn offensive with that lightning. Let's keep the flash going. I feel like they can't handle too many more rounds of this. Maybe? Is that it? Better not irritate him. He gets hungry when he's irritated. You wouldn't like him when he's irritated. He just scratches you. Let's just keep curing with her. Let's keep lightning with her. Let's keep tooling around with him. 
That was mostly for Edgar, but whatever. I don't know if this is one of those battles where I need to just kill one of them, or what the deal with this is. Still staying well ahead in this battle. This is her last bolt that she can do. But I have a feeling this is going to get done. Without having a bestiary up for Ultros in this particular moment. Sneeze. That's not cool. You just knock us onto the floating continent. Yeah. That's sad. Ultros is officially dead. And we're just fighting dudes as we fall, I guess. What the hell is this thing? I don't remember this. Not fun. All right, three shots again. Uh, let's give her tonic. Wait, no, tonic is that what I want? Is there a tincture? Can't remember. Give her a tincture. Oh, wait, when the, the hell did I get all my magic back? The hell was that? It's interesting. Tincture didn't do that. All right, whatever. Very odd. Tech laser. Yeah, you just keep doing that. And you keep hearing us. We need to put a stop to one of these guys. These are going to eat into our... Uh, they're going to catch up to us. have been falling for a very long time. Not to quote Bill and Ted too much, but there's the sequel. Question. The eternal question. Do we just start chainsawing one of them, or do we... Yeah? Okay. Cool. Launched a spec. A spec absorbs magic. So what? I can't use magic? Count six. Alright, let's just... Let's attack the spec. Is this gonna absorb the cure? It will. Yeah. Chainsaw that specs ass. Can't really. Okay, there we go. That was helpful. Nah, we can get in there with some of that sweet, sweet, sweet uh, bolt too. Should probably try something else, but whatever. I know it works. I feel like in most situations, when you have the choice between fire, ice, and lightning, lightning. Wow, nice. Okay. I think that just made my uh, my point for me. <laughs> that was pretty good. Hooray! Three magic points in the Zara ring. Because it's Zara ring. Alright, now we should be able to... Kafka gets stolen. The statues are just ahead. Just weird music here. It's like futuristic kind of music mixed with... I don't know. Something from Illusion of Gaia. I don't know. Kind of reminds me of the uh, the Sky Garden, which is similar. Oh shit! It's Shadow. <laughs> Down with the Empire. That's not cool. Because <laughs> they don't know who you're gonna have in your party at this point. Just like nondescript person. We thought you were a goner. Join us. How do we know he's our what? I don't know anything about his pop up. All right, cool, so we got Shadow and the gang now. That's why they only said you could bring three. It's so obvious, game, what you're trying to do. All right, anyway, I think we can leave now, right? I think, well, maybe not yet, but we will be able to leave. Do I kill all these things? All right. There's like a hook somewhere where it can pick us up and get us out of here. All right, um. Cool. Oh, do you have all the stuff you need, Shadow? Probably not. You need a black belt and, uh, yeah, double firepower. I like it. I like it. All right. And then, uh, I should probably give you an Esper, too, even though I know it's really not your thing. But, whatever. Do you like to cure people? <laughs> it's like, that's really not my thing. I don't know. None of these are really... Or two is probably good. Never know when we might need him for that. This will just kind of open up, yeah. Whatever that was, it parted for me. Alright, so we have to play through this a little bit before we can head back. I think we can head back. I think there's a 
part somewhere. There's like a hook or something that they drop down for us. Wow. Must use Doom on him. Uh, who has life? You have life. Give him life. And then... You, I don't like that... No one seems to have cure too. I guess Terra does, but... I feel like Sela should definitely have that. Kill, 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 slow killing, wow. It's fake me out dead. What the hell's going on with that thing, huh? Doesn't want to die? Hmm. Um. Chainsaw his ass? Alright. Yeah, Shadow has a weird weapon that doesn't necessarily kill people all the time, even though it seems like it will. Maybe just gives them back all their health every time they they fake me out die like that. But anyway, right, we're just going through all of your MP. I'm sorry about that. Good thing I've just been sitting on a shit ton of items that'll restore all this stuff. I think this is an item right here. Nice. Would this be your Shadow? No? That would be, uh, our swordsman. Swordsman. Where is this going to put me? These dragons are no joke, man. Good lord. Jeez. Dude, with too many more of those battles. Interesting. <sighs> Just throw some crap at these dudes. Otherwise, we're gonna be here all day. Nice. It's always a crowd pleaser. Light shaver. This is one of those things where you're a certain level. It, no, it just hurts you. It just kills you. Take him down. He hurt one of our own. That'll do it. Yeah. Alright. Um, yes. We should probably bring him back to life. He's very important to the cause. The general effort. That was a waste. Using it on everyone, but whatever. Alright. We're holding. Switch up top, probably, to go through there. Brain pan. Alright, we learned the hard way that that does not help Shadow's weapon. Wish he could throw something at everybody. That would be nice. Somebody always has to die to get through one of those battles. We are leveling up, just powering our way through here, but... Hmm. Oh, I can walk all around that? Okay. Where is this going to drop me? Here's the airship. Interesting. Ninjas! How do you feel about that, Shadow? a magic situation? Quite possibly. Can't run away from ninjas. But I knew that. That's ninja logic. Ninja law. Put him away. That was dangerous. <laughs> okay. Alright. So she needs, uh... She needs a tincture. She needs a few tinctures. Alright. <sighs> this continent's bleeding us. Uh, left. It's closer. 
Ding, ding, ding. There's a step. There's a switch. So that'll connect that. I guess that's good. There's another one. Drop that down. Sure. out of points. Hopefully we can get back to that ship soon. Oh, that's just a, okay. A little shortcut, I guess. So now I can go down here. So we dropped it down. With the daily. As long as he's visible, I think we got a shot. There we go. Alright, this is... Has anyone else learned anything? There you go. <laughs> That's what I was looking for. I need to be careful with that cure, too. Has everyone learned everything that they're gonna learn? Ah, that's pretty good. Let's see what else. Have you learned Zone Seek? Wow. All right, we need to move on. You need Cure Two. Who the hell's got that? Shadow. Have you learned Cure Two? Awesome. All right, so let's move everybody around. So now you can start learning Cure Two because that's probably super important for you. You can now start learning all those for some reason to get more points and then you can start learning well you already know that um, who else gives me cure too that's really slowly though I can get all these weird stupid spells that I never use feel good about that? Right. another switch Um, ah, ha, ha. good times, can't run from a ninja. I knew it before I started to, good lord. Can we get a turn in here? I'm getting reckless. Chainsaw his ass. His wiry ass, wow. That was dangerous. Hey. Okay. Alright, alright. I'm thinking Phoenix down. And then crap ton of cure. Cure one. There we go. Cure two is just for in battle. It's not for the impatient. Okay. This might be the one that sends me back to the ship, actually, now that I think about it. Let's try it. There it is. Shit we remember. All right, so now we can safely return to the ship. What? Uh, okay. I guess that was a one-shot deal. All right, so... <laughs> so let's just... Hold on, let's see. Only three allowed. So you know that Shadow's going to come back some, at some point on that damn floating continent, but whatever. All right, so I'm going to pause it here. I'm going to level up and uh, with just, you know, kind of spread the spell love around. And then we'll pick up in uh, just a second. All right. Uh, we got uh, got some experience now. Everybody's got their spells that they like. Shadow was waiting for me at the gate, basically, when I just came back in uh, to the floating continent. So he was in the exact same spot, so whatever. Um, so we got him, and uh, we leveled up a little bit while we were getting our spells up. And something to mention about these espers, which is nice, is uh, each one of them, well not all of them, but some of them, you'll see, see it down there at the bottom, at level up, magic power plus two. 
versus like Maudlin, which is magic power plus one, versus Shiva, which is nothing. So even if you already know the spells, you probably want to give them, you know, whatever you want them to have moving forward. So every time that Terra levels up now, her magic power is going to go up a little bit extra than it normally would. And uh, I have a similar deal going on with, uh, well, what's he got going on? He's got strength plus two, so that's good for attack, I would assume. He's got Shout, which is HP plus 10. So just these nice added little uh, little boosts with every level, and then she's got MP plus 10%. So. so she'll have a little bit more magic points with every level as she levels up. So just something to mention. I don't know why Like sometimes I break into like I'm doing a walkthrough with these games when really I just feel like it's more... I'll stop talking. Let's move on. So there's the ship, so we're going to move on and... Uh, and I guess that was pretty much it. So here's a boss. Well, here's some randos. And then a boss. Let's make sure we're in tippy-top shape. Took a little bit of damage there. Um, I also swapped out the party, too, and brought in, like, who to bring? Like, Locke and Sabin and uh, Cyan and, uh, you know, other people, basically, to uh, get them a little beefed up, too. Because I know what's coming next, and uh, I just want to make sure some folks are powerful. At my weapon. Wow, that's a guard dog right there, huh? I'm pure energy, and I'm just hanging out on the floating continent for some reason. <laughs> Why is he just hanging out here? It's always strange to me. Alright, so we have a lot of spells. Let's scan him, see what we can learn. Maybe some bolt. Our magic spells are kind of piddly right now. That's a lot of HP. 24,000. Not weak against anything, so we can tell at least. Let's chuck some shuriukens at him. There we go, that's a good chunk of his health right there. That's fine. Ouch, that's probably gonna hurt. Some cure two ready. Yeah, it's not great. Do that bolt thing again. The earrings are really pushing that up. That's nice. All the ladies have earrings on. Them being the chief magic users. And he is not a fan of Terra. Maybe he's not cool with the fact that she's... Don't go for the kill shot, Edgar. What are you doing? Because she's like, she's part Esper and he's not cool with that. Atma weapon is not as progressive as you would assume, you know? There you go. Alright, everybody's taking shots right there, that's not good, alright. Alright, might need to switch over to pure curatives for the ladies, and then, uh... Alright, kind of worried about him going in front of the kill shot now. Alright, you know what, Edgar? You lost your... yeah. You're going back to the, uh, the drill. That always does just straight up damage. And I like that. I like those. Yeah, the black belt's so good with Shadow because he gets those double hits in. I don't even. What's he throwing right now? But did he throw something I didn't want him to throw? I feel like he might have. It's gonna quarter our health. Shit. A little bit. Ah, but he's done. Yeah, we. Our offense was overwhelming. Pure energy, huh? Well, we just turned off the grid. I don't know. Shut up, you're dead. Edgar learned Doom. Got an elixir. Nice. So must get what? What the shit? That is so random. Alright, so he's just gone again. Ugh. Make up your mind, Shadow. He's such a diva. Alright. So now I wonder if I can go back to the ship. I feel like I probably can't get somebody else, but whatever. It's not a big deal, I guess. Alright, you. Heal everybody. That's your thing. Alright, let's just push on. Am I interrupting anything? Good, they're still perfectly aligned. We're gonna be okay. Fwa ha ha. What are they doing?
<laughs> you probably won't do that. Probably shock boat. Yeah, there you go. Uh, is she gonna do something? My pretty. <laughs> Hmm. Uh, just ha happen to have a sword for this exact purpose. Oh, I'm right. This is such a good moment. Hmm. Not a bad proposition. But... Oh. That's <laughs> so good. <laughs> Just turn around and stab. <laughs> Ouch. <laughs> Blood? <laughs> Hate, 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 Whatever. It's Gestal's power. Come on, you're just his puppet. See, I don't understand, like, wh what was Gestalt trying to do? What was the end game here? Now he's trying to stop Kafka? He just wanted, like, half power? Shit up. Oh, that's weird. They're both... Okay, that was strange. Are you nuts? <laughs> nuts? Emperor, don't disturb me. I'm showing them the meaning of power. I don't think so, friend. I just don't understand their language. It's so casual. What is so fun? He's always laughing. You know that. Very well. <laughs> Alright. Let's see. I respect that. I didn't I never knew. Fire three. Uh didn't work. Is he just absorbing it all? This is where we realize how freaking powerful Kafka is, if we haven't already. How stupid powerful he is. No! <laughs> Merton? Summoning your cousin Merton? <laughs> what? Is that a spell? I do not remember that one. <laughs> that is a good question. How is he that powerful? Oh, of course. He's standing within the field of the statues. Oh no! Damn technicalities. Why don't you just stand in there too? Incredible. I always felt kind of sad at this part. <laughs> Where are you aiming? More to the right. <laughs> Stage right. Uh, this felt bad for the Empire. <coughs> Not the Empire, the Emperor. Kefix is playing him like a fucking sucker. Oh man. Oh, <laughs> Jesus. Does he just chuck him off the side of the floating continent? There'd be no one to worship us. Kefka is frickin' crazy. Just throws him off the frickin' floating continent. It's insane. We should've slapped him when he was not standing in there. Uh. 
No! You'll destroy the world! <laughs> oh, that's really smart, Kafka. No, we had them exactly where we wanted them. No. <laughs> oh no, my OCD doesn't know how to... No, oh, process this. Yes. Fuck yeah, Shadow. We knew you weren't done. He's trying to put him back. Sort of. What did he... He just trapped him? Nice. We didn't know that would work. Ah! Count on it. Freaking shadow. Where the hell are we? Oh, there's a there's a thingy. Get out of here on the double. Is he talking to us or are we talking to him? All right, we have six minutes to hurry the hell up. Naughty. Luckily, we're relatively beefy, so we should be able to just take down everyone with relative ease. Uh, relative ease. I guess I should be chainsawing people. All right, definitely chainsaw these people. Okay. There's not really time to mess around. I feel like they give you enough time, but... Yeah. Still, you don't want to mess around. What we got this time? Another naughty. Let's just go straight for the chainsaw. How about that? Okay. Full minute's gone already. Counter, you can see it's still clearly going. Getting magic points, that's nice. You know, I think we're. Oh, hurry, hurry. Ah! That did, it's hard to tell which is br what's breaking off of what. Exactly. Frozen. Yeah, I think the timer's still going. Yep. Cure up and move! Cure up and move! something that I know you could probably make that if you're quicker oh well sorry perfection completionists who are better than me I apologize he went for the quit going for the kill shots Edgar that's the one drawback from the chainsaw I just want to do the spinny move all the time and he never does it when you need it uh, just slap around it's fine is this a safe point? That's a mini boss. Narappa. Parappa Narappa. Narappa the rapper. That's what I was trying to say. Alright, all the heavy spells. Uh condemn. This is gonna take a while. Don't really have time for that. Alright, all right, cool. <laughs> Alright, I'm sorry, I was blasting the dam. Alright, so here's the thing about this. This is one of the most important aspects of this game. You're thinking to yourself, I just made it in time. Yes, we're gonna get out of here. Or maybe I didn't just make it in time, but like I have time to spare. I'm proud of myself for getting here so damn fast. But And your instinct would be just to leave. You wanna leave and just see what happens to the floating continent and the world. But stop, wait. We gotta wait for our buddy. Our buddy being Shadow. Yes. It's a very interesting thing. If you leave right now, Shadow will actually be dead. He will never come back. I assume 90% of you who are familiar with this game know this. But for those of you who don't, those who only played it once maybe, like me the very first time I played this and just freaking left, and then I read about it in, in Nintendo Power like I'm, you know, a year later or something like that, I'm like, son of a bitch, I could have saved Shadow. So yeah, we're going to wait for Shadow, and he's going to be in our party for the rest of the game, and it's going to be awesome. He's not going to leave us anymore, because we finally, uh, you know, we played to his trust. So let's just speed this up a little bit. 
It's a very last minute thing. <laughs> they make it that way so you can be like, oh shit, 18 seconds, we better get the fuck out of here. I promise he's coming. He will be coming. He's just fashionably late. You know, Shadow. Shadow, would you hurry the fuck up? There he is. <laughs> Damn right. Come on, buddy. Let's get the hell out of here. Awesome. I wouldn't even begin to know how to defuse the statues. So now they're just destroying the world. There goes uh, Moblees. There goes that the Massa Magic Town, whatever. There goes just random forest areas that you never see. Didn't this already happen? <laughs> the world just kind of broke apart and people were jumping around not knowing which side they should be on. And there was that guy. Why, why? I never understood. Why does the airship break apart? I can see the world, like massive earthquakes and stuff, but I thought we were okay. Wow, that's fucked. Yeah, the world is completely fucked. <laughs> this is the new one for the Final Fantasy series, or it was at the time. Yeah, it's it's just it's not good. Kefka literally destroyed the world. Well, not destroyed. He rearranged the world. Did some uh, facial reconstructive surgery on the world. Mm. On that day, the world was changed forever. <laughs> Kefka won. <laughs> Came over. Oh my god. Yeah, there you go. That was Final Fantasy VI, everybody. Thank you so much for tuning in. It's been a great series. And, um, I don't know. Oh, it's not over. Okay. Now everything is just... Yeah. This is the effects of global warming right here. This is all that's left. The only above water land right here, above sea level. It's not true. But we're on this little island. It's one little shack on this one tiny little island. Who is that? Is that Celis? Can't move yet. The hell's a giant hot dog doing? Oh, it's Sid! Nice. Sid survived the end of the world. Hmm. Huh. Just me and, me and Sid, I guess. Celis and Sid. The last two people on Earth. Well, we know what we gotta do. <laughs> They're gonna do that. That music. I guess not. How long have I been out? One year? Jeez. Uh, where have you been sleeping? I can imagine. All that watching someone in a coma? I mean, what did you... After the world crumbled, I woke to find us here together with... A few strangers. Huh. Yeah, where's Locke? I think she asked about Locke first. Huh. Could be the last two people alive. The world's continued to slide into ruin. Animal and plants are dying. At least the ones on this island, I guess. We passed away with boredom and despair. At least you all didn't resort to cannibalism. You get points for that. Not resorting, I mean. My friends, they're probably all gone. No, what about gone? Cyan and Edgar and Sabin and Setzer and Locke and Terra and the whole gang. 
Aww. I guess, but that, that wouldn't make for an interesting Let's Play, Sid. Granddad. He's like, I'm two years older than you. <laughs> Aw, I guess he overdid it taking care of me over the last year. He did say. We're doing some weird role-playing stuff, I guess. Whatever. Maybe that's why you became ill. Let me get you some food. <laughs> Alright, now you can be in bed for a full year. Alright. Well, crakes. Crakes. That's the word I come up with when the world has ended. I'm, I'm overwhelmed. This is crazy. So I guess in the next episode we will try to get some uh, fish for Sid. He actually can die. We actually can save him. So we're going to try to do that in the next video. And uh, I don't know. We'll find out if there's any many one left alive in the world besides us too. So, wow. A lot's happened. Take a breath. Take a week. Or just uh, power through this if you're, you know, binge watching them all after I finish them all. That's fine too. And, um... Yeah, we'll see you in episode 13 of this Final Fantasy VI Let's Play here on Let's Play with Brigands.